Good morning, I'm First Alert Meteorologist Austin Evans. We saw some storms move through the Arklatex yesterday. They have moved on. Let's get into the forecast. Lovely shot of downtown Shreveport, a little blurry, but the sun is coming up. Can you tell I have lost an hour of sleep? But uh, some light showers still in the Arklatex, nothing major. The heavy stuff has moved off to our east. Rain chances are to ramp back up this coming Thursday and Friday in the form of our next weather maker, another late winter cold front, bringing another round of showers and storms into the Arklatex late Thursday and into Friday. Right now, severe risk is uncertain. It's a bit too far out to discuss that. Take a look here. Rain begins to move in during the day Thursday, continues through the overnight hours into your Friday morning holding on until at some point Friday should move off. But plan for Thursday and Friday, plan to bring that umbrella, and hopefully we won't have to cancel your Friday evening plans. Today, temperatures dropping throughout the day. We're going to be hitting that high early this morning. And over the next few hours, we're going to drop into the upper 50s. If you haven't yet, Spring forward your clocks, all of them. That happened at 3 o'clock this morning. Daylight saving time began. Spring forward your clocks uh, so you don't forget. Dropping temperatures throughout the day, like I said. Temperature uh, 66 in Shreveport right now. Mansfield 68, 70 in Natch Natchitoches, 71 in Hempville. Let's go through Future Track real quick with some showers holding on into the noon hour today. Cloud cover holding on as well. That will be the case throughout your Sunday. We'll see some decreasing cloud cover overnight. Monday will be a lot sunnier, but we're going to be staying cool with highs only in the 60s. Today, we're at our highs pretty much right now. We're only going to be dropping from here. Your first alert seven-day forecast showing the temperature continuing to be in the 60s through Tuesday and then we'll warm back up going into the midweek. All of up-to-date details coming up on Castle News 12 this morning.